For today's video, I'm going to be filming a boyfriend-girlfriend tag with my boyfriend. It's going to be um, soft-spoken because his whispering is a little too quiet. So yeah, um, we have 10 questions each that we're going to ask each other. And we don't know the questions yet or anything. We're just going to go like back and forth, back and forth. So Ladies yeah. first. I hope that y'all enjoy this video. It might be a little funny because he's a bit of a clown. clown. Wow, <laughs> I didn't know. I got it. All right, so, so the first one is describe me in three words. <laughs> <laughs> All right, three words. Um, let's see. Um, attitude is number one. Um, ambitious. No, let's change that to organized. Organized. Okay. I like organized more. And then the third one is beautiful. Oh. Um, you gotta <laughs> add that little sauce in there, you know. Okay. But, uh, my turn. Those were good. Right yeah. into this. Jump right into yeah. it. What is one of my weird behaviors? <laughs> Um, I don't know if it's like a behavior, but like you have, he has like his little slangs or his little sayings. Um, yeah, I'd like say what? that. <laughs> like how I talk. And yeah, stuff like, like how that. he talks. Like, um, he loves to like do different accents <laughs> or like mimic things that he watches and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, I mean, but a lot more, like, a lot of, like, slang or, like, little yeah. lingos he has. The that lingos. he comes up with. They're the funny, bad. though. Like, literally, I've been doing them sometimes, too. Like, I roll my R's and... and yeah. <laughs> it's, like, so much. Like, it's, yeah. like, I can go on because he has so the many different... <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> okay. Let's go in. Um, the next one for me is uh, where and how did we meet? <laughs> I knew you were going to come with the hard-hitting questions. Let's see. Where and how did we meet? Well, we met... Are we only talking about, like, in person? Where we met in person and everything? Like, like how that? we met and then where, like, in person? <laughs> so, it's, like, a little bit too... Okay, so where we met in person, we met at the, um... It's called the McGarden Conventional Grounds uh, downtown. It's like Herman Park. And uh, how did we meet? We met on Tinder. <laughs> yeah, so you guys, so we've been together for three years, three years. And I mean, it works. Like, it really so, does. It's a long story, but I think but, that, that answers your question. Yeah, that does answer my question. Okay, number two. Let's see. What is my favorite rap artist? <laughs> Oh, that's tough. It's I'm gonna name tough. a few because I might get wrong, but like okay. for sure he loves Pop Smoke. I'm done. You got it right. Oh, that's, okay, <laughs> I was between Pop Smoke, Travis, and Kanye, but I knew Pop Smoke had to be up there. Yeah, like, it was for sure. You know, but yeah. Alright. Go straight what into it. What is my Starbucks order? Oh. <laughs> My recent favorite. Um, I think you get <laughs> the white chocolate mocha. Mm -hmm. You get um, a grande because you don't like them inventing. And then you get light caramel drizzle. Mm -hmm. No ice. Mm -hmm. Or is it? It's like one more thing. With you know. cold foam. Sweet cold foam? Yes. Ice. Yes. Number three. Who is in my close friend circles that you say, okay, you hang out with him, you hang out with him, and you hang out with him? Okay, like top two? Top, yeah, I'll have to give you top two. two. Three. Okay, so, for sure, Tavo uh -huh. and Alan. And like recently, like Scrawn. What? <laughs> Are they gonna watch this video though? Drop a like, boys. If you've seen it, mate. If you've seen it from this far, you gotta drop a like. Okay. Um. 
next one it's kind of like the first one but it's like what drink do i order when i got to eat like if we go to like a restaurant you like or something sweet tea mm -hmm. you like on arnold palmer's and you like a soda dr pepper <laughs> you prefer mr pip but i to say yes i do yeah. i don't know mr pip tastes like way better okay so number four where is the place i would like to visit Oof. like country or you're talking yeah. like okay um i have multiple but mm. yeah i mean you've always said like argentina spain uh and now perry <laughs> france too, yeah right? but spain mostly okay um what was my first job wendy's ew Wendy's <laughs> um, Wendy's yeah trash um number five <laughs> what is your favorite memory about me oh, <laughs> favorite oh. memory that's me holy um that's hard <laughs> we've been mm -hmm. through so much um The one that comes to mind. Uh, they don't have to even be crazy. Like favorite. Favorite memories about me or about us. Don't matter. Damn, I'm gonna have to cut this stuff out because I don't I'm trying to think. I feel like being on the spot. Um I She mean, don't even remember nothing like I really liked spending like New Year's with you. We went to Colorado. That was fun, mm -hmm. you know, experience snow and everything. So like trips and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, I liked the 21 Pilots. We went to see 21 Pilots. That was cool because it was his first concert and we were like really into that. Yeah. The beginning of our relationship. I mean, yeah. I mean, we have had like so many memories. Like, I can't even think of like the oh, top one. Yeah. yeah. But I guess that's what comes to mind. Uh, uh, my number six is what's my nickname? I'm exposing nickname. myself, y'all. <laughs> Billy. Billy. So Billy. it's spelled Billy. like Billy. But since my name is Viernalis, my mom calls me Billy. But it sounds like with a B, but it's with a B, you know, so it's Billy. Yeah. And she hates it because it sounds like a boy's name. Yeah, really. I really do hate it. So my family calls me. Number six. At what point did you decide to make us official? Oof. At one point did I. At what point did you make us official? Like before you asked me out like what did i think yeah we were like okay a couple even before you You're asked like, me out because when i asked you or like i had mentioned it to you you uh, were like mm -hmm. i mean i was just like scared because we had known each other for such a small amount of time like i wouldn't even maybe like a month then i said yes mm -hmm. but it just like felt right and at the same time, I didn't want to like, I don't know, I was just, I was just scared, I guess. Um, so it was like December? So yeah, this was like, we, yeah, mm -hmm. our anniversary is in November. So I would say like, maybe once it started feeling a bit more comfortable, because like he can tell y'all, I was like really awkward. And so like, I didn't even want to like hug or like hold hands. I just, I was only in one other relationship before him. So I've always been shy. Um, so yeah, maybe December. Especially like um, in Christmas, he always goes to Mexico, so I feel like then like I really like missed him. And I had also gone actually then for Thanksgiving, I I went out of town, so like gave me time to like miss him and be like, wow, you know, like yeah, you know, you feel some type of way. <laughs> yeah. All right, so this one. <laughs> uh, what do we usually argue about, and who wins? <laughs> I think I have one like that, but, um, what do we, 
really argue about. <laughs> we always argue about where we're gonna go to eat because she does not like eating places consecutively or going to fast food to places. I like to go out. Like I like she to do dates, to go you dates know. Dates to restaurants and stuff. And I I can really care less. I'll go eat if I'm hungry. I'm gonna go eat wherever I want to. Like yeah. fast I you're wrong. I like fast food. But yeah, it's cheaper. <laughs> <laughs> but um other than that, is that like kinda what you were thinking of like arguing? I just thought it was a funny question to put what you on the it? spot. On who wins? Who wins? <laughs> she swears she wins the arguments, but I let her win the arguments. Because it's not yeah. like... It's I'm a tough cookie, for sure. You do be a tough cookie. I'm a Leo, so it shows. <laughs> okay, number seven. What soccer team do I support and which do I sus- despise? Rayados. For sure. Um, and then Tigres, you hate them. They're literally from the same city. Let's so. go. She has a little bit of knowledge because, you know, I had to drill it in here. She got a So, no. yeah. Y'all, y'all catch me in the Rayados jersey for sure. <laughs> for sure. Um, describe her first date. Like, I guess bits and pieces, like something you remember that's funny. That was actually a funny day now that you... Our first date. Yeah, like describe like I consider our first day the first day we met. Exactly, yeah. So um <laughs> the first day we went to a park and it was downtown Houston and <laughs> it was pretty dark while we were there. And for the first time we were knowing each other. I mean, yeah. at least for her, she had the confidence to be with me. A complete stranger basically. Other than uh, like messaging um the uh, the little park that we were at had a lot of trees and it was kind of like a forest and it was pretty dark it was and we were dark. running because i think we saw someone coming towards us yeah while we were on some swings so we ran away and then i remember a bit where um i was like I think, I don't know how it came up, but you were like, so who would save, would you save me or something like that? And I'm like, I mean, I'll, I'll try, like, I'll, tr- I'll stay back so you can run, but I'll just try to um, trip him and, yeah, and run away. Basically telling me he can't fight. Yeah, basically <laughs> saying I'm a, I'm a runner, not a fighter. Exactly. I'm a fight or flight, I'm yeah. picking a flight. But um, that was scary. Uh, and then afterwards we went to Wingstop, and then at Wingstop, um, I had some braces, and um, the braces weren't like the best, I guess you could say. And I was eating wings, was which I wasn't supposed to. And I bit in one, and then my freaking braces broke, <laughs> and they came out, and I was like, oh, look, <laughs> I was like I was showing like- it off. And you were like, <laughs> okay. That's well, like, I was really shy. Like, I barely made any eye contact, and he knows that. Because when we were at the park, we were kind of, we were on the swing, and we would walk, and we wouldn't be facing each other. And plus, since it was dark, I didn't feel forced to have, like, like eye, eye contact. contact. So then at the moment, at the wings up place, like, I don't know. I wasn't even looking at him in general. Just like, I was like, uh, or like looking at the TV, like, I the worst yeah. eye contact. Yeah, when I saw it, I was like, mm, she smells nice. And really pretty. He nice. was tall. I mean, he's still oh. tall, but like, the person was always like, damn, he's tall. <laughs> we were skinny back then. Now. Yeah, but it's a relationship way. That means we eating good, you know? We're still in the process of taking off that relationship okay. weight. Exactly. But, all right. Is, this, is it my turn? It's your turn, yeah. Okay, number eight. What's my Chipotle order? Oh, God. Okay, okay. He's, like, the opposite of me. So, he gets... I'm gonna just do a burrito, okay? You put the same thing on either one. Yeah. He likes his burritos. Um, He does brown rice, pinto beans, chicken, 
extra chicken. <laughs> yeah, sorry. And then the he game. does um corn. Corn. Yeah. Okay. Um the the red sauce. Is it mild? I don't know, just the red sauce. Um lettuce and <laughs> you put cheese. You do, but she, that's it, right? That's it. And if he's feeling like he'll add our um, guac. guac. That's when I'm feeling a little fancy. Yeah, but like recently, hack, get the bowl, all that stuff, and then just ask for a side of tortilla. Tortilla on the side for 25 cents. Not bad. Not bad. And you can get more in your bowl than you do in a burrito. There you go. He always says that. Life hack. <laughs> Um, what brand of makeup do I use the most? <laughs> Just God, name. The brand. Mm, let you hear me talk about. I know Morphe, and that's. I think that's about. Come it. on, no. all my videos I do about. Yeah, Blank X. Fenty. No. Fenty Color Pop, babe. Color Pop is one, yeah. That's You're saying one? that now, yeah. But, uh, I can't but I do wear Fenty, not always. Fenty Morphe. Morphe. Mm. Mm. I've been talking about them recently, yeah, but. Uh, not a clue. <laughs> what hairstyle did I rock when I was younger? <laughs> Faux hawk. Yeah. I like to wear a little boha because I was, I was one of those typical Mexicans. I did a full honk. Um, when and where did you meet my parents? Start when dive. and where? Yes. I know you met them both separately. Your mom, I met her at church. Mm-hmm. And but we had gone to eat afterwards. Um, at that Genghis Grill. Mm-hmm. I remember that. Your dad. <laughs> Tell me how you met my dad. <laughs> I remember. Come on. I met him at uh at your house. Mm-mm. You didn't. No, you're gonna meet him. Oh, it was his birthday party. No. no. I didn't know. Oh, my God. It just <laughs> dawned on me. I met him because we were going to um, this, like, youth group. Um, it was on a Tuesday because the youth group was on a Tuesday. Mm -hmm. And then leaving, we were going closer to her house so she can get home. Um, and then we went to Cane's by your house. And then from there, your dad called you. Like, oh, I'm here at Kane's with so and so, and then he was like, "Oh, really? That's the guy you've been talking to. Let me pull up." And her dad pulled up, and um, when she was, when I he was there, we were sitting by were the like, window, and we look over. No, because no, he didn't tell lived. me he was coming. Yeah. Well, he well, didn't. Well, he came over anyways. We long saw the yeah. You saw his truck, and I you were like. <gasps> And the poor guy, he no. was probably like... And I was like, what just happened? Like, what the heck? And then he's like, that's my dad. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> I was already... Like he wasn't prepared I, for that I at was all. I not prepared. I was in defeat. I didn't know what to say. I did not want to meet the man. Um, <laughs> but, you know, he came in and he ordered oh. and he came up to me. And I remember he was like, hi, Javier. And then yeah. he was like, he always, you said that, um, oh, he always says that, but his name is actually Elmer. Harrison. Yeah, because he used that, like, as a business, like, ooh, yeah. like, I'm trying to... Formal. Yeah, formal, when his name is literally Elmer. But, um, and I was like, oh, Christopher, and I gave him, I remember giving a nice firm handshake, like <laughs> I was in an interview or something like that. And, but I mean, it was, I don't regret, like, nothing, you know? Yeah. I had to meet him eventually. But, yeah, I felt bad. I feel like if it was the other way around, I'd be so, like... <laughs> I had some of my last one. 
This is kind of like the one, but what do we argue about the most? It's kind of mm. like yes. I, I had trouble thinking of my last question, but what do we argue about the most? Um, I guess like you said, like the food, but oh, we always argue about like who makes the plans because I'm. I'm a planner, like you said, I'm organized, mm -hmm. so I feel like I'm always planning, like, when we hang out, um, what days we're gonna see each other, like, I'm always like, what's your schedule as soon as he gets it, like, this is my schedule, and, like, we have, like, a few days off, like, yeah. similar, and I'm always like, okay, we're gonna see each other this day or this day, and we're gonna do this or this, so, like, sometimes, like, I want him to be like, I'm gonna see you this day, because yeah. I feel like I'm telling him, like, he has to see me that day. I want him to, like, plan something, but I feel like that's just, like, I'm just like that. I mean, I've been like that since the beginning of the relationship, so he's probably just, like, and, I'm used to it. Like, and I'm no. more, like, unorganized, and, like, I'm really, like, a last-minute planner, and I, like, go with the flow. So, if something happens this in, uh, next week, I'm like, oh my god, okay. Like, let's say something happens the day of, and I'm like, oh, my friends don't want to go somewhere, but they want to do this. It's always last minute. But when uh, Verna always has, like, plans and stuff, like, okay, this day we're doing this, this day. And then mm -hmm. I'm like, uh, okay, yeah, that's cool. Like, I'll, if I have it programmed with her, then, you know, I have to, like, follow, like, her. But um, sometimes where, um, like, it's a last minute plan, I'm like, Oh hey babe, like I want to do this, this with my friends or whatever. It's just and then like she reminds me, we have this, 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 and I'm like, oh my god, I totally forgot because I'm like a last minute like planner and like I, I just go to with the like, flow. Though, because I know his friends like work and they have their own stuff going on, and I know like for us, I don't work as much as I used to, so like we can like work around it and all that stuff but yeah it's not more that it's just like okay we're gonna see each other for example thursday and like i would want him to be like okay we're gonna do this not so much like yeah she wants me to take initiative and have the the pants exactly. in the relationship exactly which, because it seems like i have them oh. <laughs> which seems like it's like something that i have to work on because i'm not more like uh I'm lazy. I just He's don't more like do this. chill. Yeah, like, like if chill. we don't chill do life. anything, he'll be happy. Like he's fine with that. Not happy, but I'm. But like, you're fine I'm, with it. I'm, yeah. I'm okay. Like we don't have to go out every week. Or we don't have to. You know. We don't. Um, but obviously, I love spending time with you. It's yeah. like more of like, hey, and like she's like, basically saying like, put in a little bit more effort. Like show a little bit more effort, which I acknowledge that I need to, but. I just don't, I wish it doesn't affect the relationship in any way. I know, but I would say in my case, that's what we argue the most about. And like, what do we want to eat and like do? So I guess what, what we want to do or eat is like the top two. And then beforehand, I'd say just a little advice for like, yeah. um, <laughs> guys or girls, you know, just relationship couples. Um, what we also argued about the most in the I beginning know. was I money. I didn't want to talk about it. But hey, but we gotta talk. We're here to speak facts. We're here to speak <laughs> truths. If what and maybe we do absolutes. Okay. So for money, money was an issue because of me, not because of her. But you know, if you're a guy, you have to boom, boom. You gotta get moving. You gotta get working. Because how else are you gonna spend money for, um, like for dates? For okay, I want to get her this. I want to get her but that. But it's understandable because he wasn't in a relationship to exactly. so where he needed to like have a job, exactly. and he was focused on soccer in high school, in school and like all this stuff. So it was understandable. We met in 2018. So I didn't have so, like an, an and you can cut this all out if you don't want to. But um, I had a necessity of like. Or I didn't have the necessity of um, needing money every day because uh, I didn't have a girlfriend. I never went out with my friends because I like to stay home. I'm more 
of the homebody chilling, mm -hmm. relaxing, and uh, on my PC or whatever. And um, and then when I met Verna Lee, she was like, oh, let's go here, let's go out. And she's like more like dragging me out and going mm -hmm. over many places, which I appreciate because like now I've been more outgoing, more talkative, more um, getting to know places, wanting to go places and stuff like that. But <laughs> uh, and I went off on a little tangent. No, but like, yeah, that was like the number one thing in the beginning. Um, it's just like pushing him to get a job and stuff because obviously I didn't mind like putting in my money but like as a boyfriend like getting me something going out and as paying, a guy like that. as a guy like I wanted to like pay for everything and I did like I didn't want to ask my parents for money and like there was some situations where it was hard to like you know find the money and so it was like I was in like a little um how do you say it like a little tough like a little tough situation mm -hmm. like not compared to like real life tough situations yeah, exactly. but you know like little struggles and um and then from there like I started working and grinding and yes. from there now we're pretty we're pretty good on that area <laughs> so yeah I guess you could say that's like a top three things we fight about mm -hmm. but I'm sure a lot of relationships go through the same thing, so mm -hmm. look at us now. But never to the point where we argue and it gets like really bad. Yeah. Like we never had mm -mm. those, you know. <laughs> I'm the trouble when you She's the trouble. I'm, I'm the one that like, stuff. okay. And if she starts something, I always have to say I'm sorry. I always say for, I'm sorry and... I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. You gotta, but I'm the type to just, I'm not, um, like, not really hold grudges and stuff. So I it's don't like, hold grudges either, if we though. Get mad, but if I get mad at you, I'm like, okay, I'm sorry, I did this, this, this wrong. Mm -hmm. And if you did something, I'm like, okay, like, I, I recognize that I did this wrong. That what made you mad. I don't think we've ever gone to bed, like, mad, though. Like, one of mm -hmm. us always pushes to, yeah. like, get a hold of and each other. And that's what I've always told her, um... In the beginning of the relationship was that i never want to like not talk about it not talk mm -hmm. it out and go to sleep mad at each other for one reason or another yeah. which it has happened i'm not gonna say it hasn't happened mm -hmm. but, but like, we always rarely. try yeah. like if we like stop talking to each other like stop texting um it like, doesn't take, go more than an hour yeah though. we always like cool down and then after we cool down i text her or she texts us first like it's like oh hey um I just didn't like this, 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 and then, okay, I recognize I did this wrong, and mm -hmm. I did this, this, this wrong, and I don't like that, this, you, you did this, or that, and that's how it goes, but I feel like we, we're doing pretty well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so that is it for today's video for the boyfriend and girlfriend tag. I really hope that y'all enjoyed, and if y'all do like more of like soft spoken i can do more of those for y'all and more videos with my boyfriend y'all let me know as well so yeah i hope y'all have a great night or day wherever y'all are at and i will see y'all in my next video